Okay. Sure, sure, sure. We can do that. We can do that. We can do that. Let's uh let's keep it rolling, shall we? This is for uh D Teleborno. We'll see if we can find some success with it. Uh, I'll, I, if I like the first team we see, maybe I'll copycat. If not, we might go back to that charger bug team we just had some success with and see if we can keep, uh, keep things going. Yeah. Maybe we'll just see if we can keep things going. Pop tart kitten is our first opponent. Good luck, friend. Vigoroth. Sure. Sure, 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 sure. The question here is, uh, do we and how do we just stay in this fight, right? I don't really care. I, I kind of like the moveset we're on. It's the moveset I've traditionally used with it. So we're going to stick with that for now. Teleborno didn't specify moveset, so. Okay. We're going to stick with the moveset we're on. So I shielded mostly because we CMP'd there. Um, if I can win this at parity, I'm pretty happy. Um, if they shield again, then I think we've got... Ooh. And obviously either of these Pokemon will be pretty good here, but like... Ooh, they flame charged me. Well, I'm not giving them an in here to uh, no shield and get value. Right? We're not going to give them... We're not giving them that choice. Yeah. We're not giving you that option. <laughs> Fine. Nope. It's a Claude Sire in the back. We have to put some real damage on him before going to one of our other Pokemon here. Um, now, let's see. I mean, we're going to just go now. But Stone Edge is real. Like, don't get me wrong. The problem is Stone Edge is a one-shot us. So I don't need to shield this first move regardless of what it is. Um, right? Here's Stone Edge. <laughs> you're, not, you're not winning this. I've played the matchup a lot. You need you need some advantage there to actually make that uh, a winnable fight, right? You need you need some advantage. Okay, hey, we gotta win with it. We gotta win with it. Help that our opponent uh, hard swap Talon Flame into us, and also baited. That also helped, but um, you know, feeling pretty good about that. Feeling pretty good about that. Let's see if we can keep uh let's see if we can keep it going. Alright, so Suke, what do you got for us? We've got Mantine and another Vigoroth lead. What a surprise. It's Vigoroth all the way down. All the way down. Yeah, it's fine. Look, I know that we're going to eat that. It's okay. <laughs> There's just not a lot I can do about it, right? Not a lot we can do about it. The thing is, is the team is not really soft to Vigoroth in like a way that I'd be concerned. Uh, the problem is just that we don't really have 
like you know what my, my concern is so we'll, we'll soft lose this right if they've got an obama snow in the back we just lose from here right <laughs> i mean this isn't great either right this is pretty this is pretty rough throw something at me I don't like how I don't like how they're doing their energy here it's a lot of energy to, to contend with and then what wish cash okay well that's probably going to be too much for us. Probably too much for us, right? We're still behind a shield. If they... <laughs> if they uh, don't have Blizzard... Like, if they don't have Blizzard... I guess we're not behind a shield anymore. All right, well, yeah, we're, we're at shield parity now. So that's nice, but... Maybe, like... I think, I think we're gonna go... We have a couple things going for us here. One, like... I We both have a shield still. So them shielding here will tell me a lot. I don't know that you shield here, shield there if you have Blizzard, right? I don't know if you shield there if you ha if you don't have Blizzard. I think we're I think we're actually in pretty good shape here, right? Because that dies. Yeah, we just we we eat whatever this is. It's gonna be a Skull, but now we can shield an Aquatail for the win, right? Ah, they have Mud Bomb. They do have mud bomb, so so they did not have blizzard, but also, <laughs> but also we we'll take those. Yeah, we I mean we got him in a pretty a pretty good spot after essentially setting up um where we were they had a hard time just killing either of those pokemon and we were just putting on a lot of damage pretty quickly and so we managed to overcome some nonsense shielding that brave bird worked out really nice for us um it would have been very difficult i think to win that game if we had not um but and the misalignment of the switch clock was a huge deal for us right the quag being a, a bit of a problem for our opponent where they had to like consider staying like that actually worked out really nicely so yeah, it worked out really nicely for us all right mandu good luck friend what do you got for us we've got a dragonite lead oh my oh my um what do we do here our team's fine into dragonite right All right, I'm gonna throw the I, I'm gonna no shield and throw the ice beam uh, because I can switch into any of my remaining Pokemon and feel pretty okay. Right, up a shield. And we'll just chew. They're going to get a... They'll get a... Oh, nope. They did not get their Dragon Claw. That's unfortunate for them. Oh, no. If Quag is their best Altaria counter, them not getting that Dragon Claw is really bad for them. Right? That's really bad for them.
Okay. I'm just gonna I'm gonna two shield through this. We'll come out with a we'll come out with a move. And I'll have functionally three Pokemon to uh <laughs> Oh, it's Decidui. Ah. Uh, okay. That is a little awkward, right? And by a little awkward, I mean it's it's pretty awkward. Yeah, kill this. I don't know what uh, I I have no idea what the counts are like on this, right? But they're not fast enough. <laughs> I was like, uh, so I can go into Quag, but if I go into Quag, I think we're just definitely gonna lose. If I go into uh, Altaria, we might just get that sky attack and find a way to win the game. It might just happen, and it did. So lucky us. We never had to show him that our last Pokemon would have absolutely gotten dumpstered there. All right. Well, yeah, they would struggle against an Obama Snow for sure, right? Mantine is pretty good into their back line, although Quag handles Flyers okay. Uh, another Vigoroth. That's three of four Vigoroths in this one, by the way. We've seen a lot of Vigoroths. Um, so far, we've just been kind of on the soft lose to Vigoroth and to try our best plan. Um, but depending on what their back line is, that may or may not work for us, right? It just depends on what's in the back. We certainly can't... Uh, oh. Do we just stay? Like... I'm kind of inclined right now to just stay here. I mean, one, we get to do that, which feels pretty good, but like. Yeah, I mean, Altaria is pretty good into it, but Altaria is also our best Vigoroth counter, so. I'm not in love with this. If it's ta if it is Talon in the back, which we have seen these sort of like double flyer Talon flame teams, we're gonna be pretty happy. Uh, I think we're just we're just chewing here though. I don't think we're shielding anything Mandibuzz do does. Right. And if Vigoroth just coming back. Yeah, we've got almost two sky attacks now. Yeah, that'll be a GG's. Yeah, makes sense. Swap the Mandy bait out lantern. Yeah. You put some damage on it, Vigoroth cleans it up. All that makes sense, right? All of that makes sense. Uh, but the team is pretty good into Talon, right? Like every one of these Pokemon is pretty good into Talon. If we win, we're expert. You might be right, actually, Badruga. You might be right. <laughs> All right, Radford. Good luck, friend. What do we got? Mantine and Whimsicott. Well, that's a good lead for us. It's a very good lead for us. Okay. They're on fly. Okay. I mean, I think we're favored here going straight stone edge basically the whole way down. So I'm not going to give them, not going to give them a, uh,
the satisfaction here. Although, like... There is a bit of a downside here. If they shield again, I don't actually know that I can get to another one. So it's possible landing the fly means that... Uh... Oh, I should have thrown the Aqua Tail. That was, a, that was a bit of a misplay on my part. That was a misplay on my part. I also don't have Water Pulse, so I'm in kind of an odd spot. I definitely misplayed, misplayed my position really badly there. Like, really badly. And they get another move off. Ah, uh, shit. We're in, we're in a, we're in a pickle. To say the least, we're in, we're in a bit of a pickle here. Ah, uh, it's fish. And this thing's going to have Moonblast, right? So I think we're, I think we're, I think we're toast. Unfortunately, I misplayed my position kind of badly, but also uh, once they eliminate the Quagsire, fish is pretty good into us, right? So... I don't know how we beat it. Ow. So we needed to put Altaria into the Talon Flame. And still we would have struggled a little bit, right? Unfortunately, I just think their backline their back was much better than ours. And uh, I misjudged what we could do with uh, Quagsire. So I probably should have uh, played that a little, little differently, but that's okay. That's okay. We still, uh, we still got four wins, right? So 